How's it going everyone? What you're going to see today is a pretty good chopper gunning round I got the other day. Uh, and the reason I wanted to post it so much is because I know a lot of you guys that have been around for a while used to love my chopper footage that I put up in Xbox. And believe me, I still love choppers, I still love flying, I still love gunning. And I did gunning pretty good here. Um, but the main reason I had to stop posting them so much is because again... And it, you, a lot of you guys that have already followed me for a long time already know this. My internet is absolutely god-awful. It gets choppy when I try to run things in choppers. Uh, either what happens a lot of the time is either when I'm, t when I'm piloting the thing, it gets so choppy and I get so laggy a lot of the time that it'll show me being a little choppy and then in the next footage the chopper's blowing up and my gunner's yelling at me saying, what the hell just happened? And it's just straight up leg. That's all it is. Uh, and that's why I had to stop for the meantime. And that one goes right through the back of that chopper. That irritated me. The hit detection on these things, the TV missiles, is absolutely terrible. Uh, I hope that's fixed for Battlefield 4. But yeah, this was a pretty good round, so I figured I'd post it. Uh, if you look in the kill feed, you'll see a familiar name for a lot of you. X Factor Gaming was in this one. X Factor was playing in this server. Uh, for the most part, he killed a lot of guys in the chopper, because I joined late, uh, and he joined, he killed a lot of guys in the chopper for the most part. I don't think he had, uh, his pilot, that guy that he usually has for the Death or Above series he runs, playing with him, but he was killing a lot of people in that chopper. Uh, but when I saw his name in the, because that's the first time I'd ever seen him in the server, when I saw his name in the server, I immediately was like, yes, let's go kill X-Factor. Uh, I definitely wanted to go out and kill some, because there were a couple of YouTubers in this one. X Factor was definitely one of them, but he was number one on the list of guys that I wanted to kill on the other team. Uh, but this match itself, and you'll notice when I pop up the score, uh, the the scoreboard for the most part was pretty awful in my part. I was ignoring my mini map. I was I wasn't checking my corners. I was just rushing around blindly to try and find X Factor, and I was getting myself killed in the stupidest ways that an intelligent player would never have happened to them. And it's it's on me. Purely on me, stupid deaths on my part. Until I got in the chopper here and I had a pretty good run. But for those for those of you that were interested, uh, X Factor and I got in three different three different situations where we fought each other. Two of them were gunfights, and we each won one apiece in terms of the gunfight. So it was pretty interesting. The third death uh, was well, the like the third encounter, I died. But the unfortunate part is that it was one of the more embarrassing deaths that I've had on me in a while and it came of course at the hands of X Factor because picture this uh, a guy that you've seen on YouTube for a while now that has a hundred thousand subscribers your first time you get into a match that you want to go out and you're definitely hunting him and the one time where you're caught right in the middle of the open after you jump off a spawn beacon a dirt bike runs me over and X Factor is the guy that runs me over of course of course um, I didn't think for the most part that uh, like, I, of course, this will sound like me complaining, but I didn't think the dirt bike hit me. I'm like, oh, I'm clear. Then it actually manages to hit me, and I'm, I'm like, please don't be X Factor Gaming. And it, it was X Factor Gaming. He ran me over with the dirt bike. But it was pretty good. We faced each other three times. He won two of them, one with a dirt bike. The gunfights were one and one at piece, which was pretty interesting. Um, he didn't stay the whole match. You won't see it in the end scoreboard either. Um, I'm pretty sure he left either well right now when i'm in the chopper or just shortly after because when i pull up the scoreboard after you won't see him there and that's because he did leave we ended up winning this we because when i joined late we were down i think 100 tickets and i'm like ah oh, well we're probably going to lose this team's pretty good x factors in it uh but we did a pretty good job i was able to crush a lot of the tanks off these flags which we immediately took after in the chopper uh, and for the most part, all of us were just running around collecting flags. It was a pretty good team effort on our part, even though I knew absolutely no one on it. I was pretty sure all the guys that I've seen in YouTube channels, big and small, were playing on the other team. So, it was pretty good. That was a pretty good chop around. The hit detection on these TV missiles is awful. I hope they fix it in Battlefield 4. Uh, but this was a quick chopper gunning round that I put up because I figured a lot of you guys enjoyed it in the past. I sure as hell love choppers, and if my internet was better, you'd see a chopper run pretty much every week. So I hope you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and well, I'll see you later.